Mm. So what do you think of those red blood cells? Mm, they are strange shapes. Like this little one looks like a mouse or something. See his little ears, his little tail, tiny little foot. Okay, maybe I've been looking at slides too long. I mean, those are normal-ish, I normal. think. This is a, like, you know, that's like Italy or something. I don't know. They're very irregularly shaped. And then these are platelets, right? Those are platelets. Are they bigger than usual or is that is that okay? They're slightly bigger than usual, but in order to call a giant platelet, it has to be the size of a red cell. So I will point out that there are some elliptocytes and ovalocytes on the slide. And this is actually a patient who had a history of hereditary elliptocytosis that developed hereditary pyropoikilocytosis after his he got a transplant. Pyropoikilocytosis. Pyropoikilocytosis. So pyro like the flame. Okay. Um, so the red cells become um, stable at higher temperatures. And oh. Fragment. So you will see also some spherocytes here. Yeah. And it's actually the opposite of what really happens with pyropoikilocytosis because normally you have pyropoikilocytosis in the pediatric population and they will sometimes grow out of it and develop hereditary elliptocytosis. Huh. And he eventually cleared this again, but it was sort of a clinical mystery as to like, how? And I think that they call it that because it almost resembles this picture. They're not quite as funny looking. Okay. But this is what you see in a burn patient. Oh. But these are very, very, very small microcytes. And they're not, these are the spherocytes. See how they have no central pallor? And they're darker color, right? Because the hemoglobin's color. all bunched up together, I guess. And see, the central pallor remains here. So they're not oh, fragments. Yeah. They're just really, really small microcytes. Huh. And that is one of those, like, they put this picture up, and they would expect you to know that this is a burn picture. Okay. A burn patient. So those are microcytes. So micro... Like micro microcytes. Micro microcytes. Not even, like, iron deficiency micro or thalassemia microcytes. They're smaller so than that. So small. So, so little small. little tiny donuts. And then also having spherocytes, does that go along with burn, too? Yes. Okay. Interesting. So I'd expect the RDW on this patient to be quite high. Because you've got tiny and big and everything in between, right? It's right. a range. Okay. Although these little tiny ones may get counted as platelets. Because they're so of small, red yeah. Red blood cells. So you might have to adjust your platelet count. Okay.